All right, slime ball. I hope you're watching this, because no matter what happens here today, I won't rest until I tracked you down. Daniels, thank God you're here. Hey, Harry. What's with the camera? It was left here by the bomber along with the briefcase. The note attached said he didn't want to miss a minute of you defusing the bomb. Yeah, I still can't believe he asked for me specifically. So I hear this is your first solo job. A lot of pressure to put on a new guy. Yeah, I've assisted on thousands of these things. It's a good thing this is an abandoned building, though. You know, just in case. Uh, yeah, this building isn't abandoned. In fact, the bomber left explicit instructions that he would detonate the bomb prematurely if we tried to evacuate. Oh, I, uh, was under the impression that there were no lives in danger. Yep, tons of people. Hell, the whole top floor is crammed full of members of the United Nations. They're on some kind of field trip. Members of the United Nations? I'm sorry, I didn't mean to confuse you. Every member of the United Nations is on the top floor, so, uh... FYI, if this thing goes off, we may be at war. Um, maybe we should get a seasoned vet in here to take care of this. <coughs> no, no, no. You're the whole reason he planted this thing in the first place, remember? He said he wanted to teach the police force a lesson for hiring such a nitwit. So the pride of the entire force is resting on your rather tense shoulders. Yeah, you're right. I'm gonna prove this bomber wrong. That's the spirit. You know, not to add any pressure or anything, but every television network in the state stepped into the camera feed there, so you have about six million viewers watching you right now. Everyone in the state? New here. Oh, so you heard me bad-mouthing you, honey, you stunted slime. Well, you can smooch my backside for all I carry, retarded ape anus. I'm just gonna... Hold on a second, will you? It's the bomber. Are you sure? Hey, I'm willing to bet our lives and the lives of every high school student in the magna class on the third floor. There are high school students on the third floor? Don't worry, only about a hundred or so. Well, listen, mister, if we can have a conversation about you resorting to that kind of language, I'm just going to hang up right now. You're what? Well, go ahead and move the timer up by ten minutes. We can handle it, no sweat. He just moved the timer up by ten minutes. But that only gives us two minutes. Don't let him intimidate you, Daniels. I believe in you. So you can just... Uh, hello? Hello? He hung up! That rude or what? No time to talk now. I've only got two minutes to defuse this thing. And everybody's a rude Nelly today. <laughs> huh. Hello? What? You're kidding me? The President of the United States? Well, he's a little busy at the moment, but I repeat everything the President says. Hey, kid, the President has a message for you. He says... The entire nation's behind you. Your only hope of preventing a massive war that will cost thousands of lives. We're all counting on you. Please be a hero and not a zero. Well, inspiring words. No wonder he's the president. Uh, oh, man. What's the matter, kid? I just can't take the pressure. We don't have time for this. You have to deactivate the bomb. I can't. You have to. If you could now, what would your mother say? I don't know. Well, I could ask her if you like. I think she's on the fifth floor at the Women's Auxiliary. Ah! One of us should check that out. Activated. You did it, kid! You beat the barman at his own game! Yeah!